seen before here. And it could be the last supper for Melbourne. And being brushed aside easily, Melbourne. Just a leaf on North Melbourne's freeway this afternoon. Uh, look, I, re- I reckon it's one of the saddest times uh, for Melbourne supporters and the club as a whole. I, as a Melbourne member and as a Melbourne uh, person who loves their club dearly, uh, we're watching the club decay before our very eyes. It is, it's in free fall. And <clears throat> whether it's on field or off field, you cannot see any light at the end of the tunnel. Very sad news from Melbourne this morning. AFL legend and beloved Victorian Jim Steins losing his two and a half year battle with cancer this morning. Good evening. The AFL community is mourning the death of Crows assistant coach Dean Bailey, who lost his fight to cancer this morning. The 47-year-old husband and father of two had been battling the disease for just three months. Now, Friday at its unscheduled meeting, the board uh, decided that uh, Mark Neal uh, would, should not continue as coach of the Melbourne Football Club. They decided that that decision should take effect immediately. Yeah, the Melbourne Footy Club have given me a great opportunity and um, I'm very thankful that I'm in the position I am. I'm glad to announce that I'm, I'm going to be up here playing in Sydney and what's a very uh, exciting future for this football club. And you know, I saw this as a fantastic opportunity to come up here and, and really be part of something special. It was a bitter and horrible way, Damo, for the season to end. I think it's going to be a long summer for Melbourne. Timber. 